Dr. Gitterman, how do you do? I'm Lucy Carmichael. Yes. Thelma tells me we've got a little problem. By next week, she wants me to get some power into that little tiny voice of yours. <laughs> oh, well, I don't know that I have such a little tiny voice. Oh, would you mind giving me a sample? Uh, down by the old mill tree. We're having a moment to lose. <laughs> Now, the first thing I teach my pupils is correct posture. Well, but Dr. Gitterman, wouldn't you like to take off your coat? We haven't got that much time. Oh, <laughs> you have time to take off your coat. The first thing I teach my pupils is correct posture. Yes, now, let sir. me see you stand, please. Yes, sir. Is that your posture? <laughs> well, it sure looks like mine. <laughs> well, if you want to be a singer, you're going to have to learn to stand up straight. <laughs> Not quite so stiff. You've got to learn. You've got to learn to relax. Yeah, do as I do. Yeah. Now, completely relax your entire body. <laughs> imagine yourself. Imagine yourself a marionette. You have absolutely no control over your actions. Someone is pulling the string, and you must do exactly as he says. Mrs. Carmichael, what are you doing? I think there's a new man on the string. <laughs> well, now that we've got you relaxed, let's get back to your posture. Now, now stand straight, but remain relaxed. Yes, sir. Now, that, that is the correct posture for yes, a singer. Sir. Yes, sir. Now, the next thing we want to discuss is breathing. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, the breath is most important. The breath, after all, is that power that operates the vocal cords. Where do you breathe? Oh, anywhere I happen to be, it's a place. <laughs> <laughs> well, the correct placement of the breath on the vocal cords is very important. You see, it's that that produces the, the proper the tonal quality. Yes, sir. Why mm. oh, no. Sit down over here and relax. The breath hitting the vocal cords at exactly the right spot that nature intended will give you a sound like this. Ah! <laughs> That's merely a sound I'd like you to imitate. That is very good. You shall promise. Thank you. Yes, now I want you to chew your tongue and hum. <laughs> chew my tongue and hum. <laughs> That loosens the vocal cord. Now, at the same time, same time, I want you to think of your voice as an umbrella that closes and opens like this. Now, continue to chew your tongue and hum. <laughs> 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 Wouldn't open. <laughs> 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 we'll try the vowels now. The vowels? The vowels. A, A, O, O. With me, please. A, 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 O, O. A, A, O, O. Fast. A, A, O, O. A, A, O, O. Try another one. Ooga! 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 Not doing it right at all, Mrs. Carmichael. You're not using your glasses. 
Perhaps I've been going along a little too rapidly yes, for you. Sure am. Let's try something else. Now, All right. I? Now, to breathe correctly, you must you must use the the suction power of your lungs. Yes, sir. Now, I will tell you what I want you to do. I want you to take a deep breath and hold it. I take a very deep breath. Yes, sir. Mm, hold it. <laughs> deep breath and hold it. Oh. Oh, hi, Dr. Gitterman. Oh, hello, Selma. How are you? Hi, thanks. Yes. I'd like to meet the other members. Oh. Maybe in May. Well, I think we can show a little progress. Oh, what's the matter with her? Huh? Oh, I forgot, Mrs. Carmichael. Oh, I say. Oh, I'm so sorry. I, I, I forgot about you. As I must say, I'm amazed at how long you were able to hold your breath. You must have very powerful lungs. Thank you. <laughs> well, I will do that. And let's show our friends what we've done, huh? <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Remember everything I taught you. The posture. You've got to relax. Remember the, remember the proper breathing. And chew your tongue and hum. And your umbrella. <laughs> 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 